eight on that list. And of course, for Chinese players, it is an event where China does have a stronghold. And we know that already in the tournament, the bottom half of the draw, all Chinese affair. And Sun Yu has already booked her place Let's in the welcome final. The court officials to court one for the women's singles. <laughs> A little bit Play of disappointment. Of court one. The event All the way from Chinese Taipei, World Rank number six, withdrew after two very hectic weeks at the India Super Series event. And she's won. going against World Rank and number seven from China, the Malaysia Wang Super Yi. Series event. But when you consider this young lady won the Super Series finals in Dubai at the end of last year. This matchup is one that I have been particularly looking forward to. And it was this event five years ago where Tai Su Ying really made the world sit up and take notice because she came through the qualifying draw as a 15-year-old, reached the final where she lost out to Sina Nawal and turned 16 on finals day. They're the youngest ever finalist of a Super Series tournament. Tai Su Ying up against the two-time defending champion Wang Yihan. So as far as the women's singles draw is concerned, five different nations involved at quarter-final uh, stage. And as I was saying, the number one seed uh, departing before we got underway. Sun Yu already through to tomorrow's final, having beaten the number two seed, Wang Shexian, in the bottom half of the draw. What a tremendous quarter-final it was yesterday with Wang Yi Han against former world champion Arachanuk Hinton on. If you were with us yesterday, you would have enjoyed that very much indeed. So the two players already starting the warm-up period on court. And there is the defending champion, the 27-year-old from Shanghai. Up one place in the world ranking this week to number seven. The number four seed, she has been world number one. Faye first became world number one on the 29th of October 2009. A total of 118 weeks as world number one. So for her to be down at number seven, well, uh, she will want to put uh, that right by easing up the rankings once again. So winner of this title for the last two years. And she had her problems in her last two rounds in the second round against former Singapore player, but now representing the United States of America, Chang Bei Wen, dropped the opening game there, as indeed she did in the quarterfinal yesterday in the battle of the former world champions against the number six seed, Arachanok Intanon. Hour and six minutes, as you can see, for yesterday's quarterfinal. It really was a fascinating contest. So to the number five seed, Tai Su Ying of Taipei, the 20-year-old uh, number six in the world ranking. That's the highest she's ever been. This is her 10th week in total as number six in the world. Making her sixth appearance, and when you consider that she's only 20, that just emphasizes the point that for her to reach the final as a 15-year-old turning 16 on finals day, that was remarkable. Now, she hasn't played against another seeded player. Her quarterfinal yesterday against uh, Maria Phoebe Kasuma Stuti of Indonesia was pretty straightforward, as indeed were her other two matches. Chetarang Vishwanath. And on my left, Sri Lanka, Tai Su Ying. 
Chinese Taipei. Tai Suyun to serve the wall. Le. So this is the fifth meeting between these two players. Semi-final of the OUE Singapore Open. One of the previous four encounters, I can tell you that honours are evenly shared. Two wins apiece. And the last time they played was in the One destination low. Dubai Super Series Finals at the end of last year. Tai Su Ying winning on that occasion. In fact, the match never concluded because Tai Su Ying was a game and 11-8 up when Wang Yihan retired injured. Service over, one all. Just wide. Well, I Two, always used one. to think there was something very special about trying to defend a title. Somehow, even extra desire and motivation. Something belongs to you. So it's over. You don't want Two, to give it up. All. Service over, three, two. Hey. Oh, Four, Tai Su Ying is two. a player who's got incredible deception. Wonderful, wonderful racket skills. And a pretty laid back character. Off the court that is. Five, two. clear as well and again yeah that is utterly brilliant and a wonderful example of what I was talking about the disguise the variation in shots Position Tai Su Ying. Five all. Managed to play a winner from it. Four straight points to go into the lead, Tai Su Ying. Yeah. Oh, landed in. My goodness, the drift coming back, Seven, bringing five. it back in, and both players having a little smile about that. Goodness, mate. 
Oh, she thought it was going a long way out, and so did I. But look, it came back in. Short. Oh. Oh, that is delightful. Six straight points now for Tai Su Ying. Eight, five. Final shot just looks so casual as she plays the winner. Ah! Oh, she was waiting for that. Service over, six, eight. Well, it made the error, hit it into the net. But that'll send a message to the defending champion. wide oh she's taken it yeah. no question of that though. definitely wide service over nine six well Wang Yi Han trying to become only the second player female player that is in the history of the super series to win three consecutive Super Series titles in three years at the same Super Series event. Already won two consecutive titles here, going for a third. The only other player to win three consecutive titles at a particular Super Series was Jiang Yangjiao, won the China Masters in 2008, 2009 and 2010. Of course, Li Chong Wei has three times won the same tournament three years running China uh, sorry the Indonesia Malaysia and Japan of course Malaysia he won Eight, incredible seven nine. consecutive times it's gone wide yeah, there's a lot of pace and pressure been put on Eight. her opponent by this young lady, Tai Su Ying. Service over nine ten. Was slight hesitation there from Wang Yi Han. And as she made the error, she looked back down towards the line. I think she should have perhaps left it. I think it may have gone wide. But that's purely academic now. This one here. Look, she's hesitant. Decides to play it in the end. Two-point advantage for Sad Tai Su Ying. Court one, 20 seconds. Court one, 20 oh, seconds. I remember after the Super Series finals last December, Tai Su Ying having won the title. I remember that Sung Ji Hyun, top Korean player, and of course the number three seed in this tournament, who lost in the second round, said that Tai Su Ying was now as good as the top Chinese players. Well, she's proving that 11, so far nine, today. Play.
Oh, look, at that. look at the skill. The disguise 12, rolling nine. the racket head around the shuttle, keeping it straight. Yeah, but look how the racket head finishes as if the shot is going to go across court. That's why it causes so much disguise. Stayed in. 13 9. serve is long of the back line that's good judgment from Hun. 10 13 She's overdone it. It's gone wide. Goodness me, it didn't have to be that close 14. to the line. Wang Yi Han was not moving at all. Oh, oh no disguise on the turn of serve. You just simply don't know where the shot is coming. Desperation shot to me from 16, 11. Think about it. 17, 11. Thundered off the top of the tape and fell back our own side. And it was a real opportunity for Wang Yi Han. And the look of disappointment tells the story. Oh, that's nice. That's over. 12. 17 13 17 Oh, she's always adventurous in her style. That's why she's such a delight to watch, Tai Su Ying. Yeah, finds the line. That's a brilliant smash. Precision play. 18, 14. Oh, 
Oh, goodness. Well, having smashed straight down the line the previous rally, they're mixing it up. Good use of the body smash. And look, it's so powerful, so much disguise. Wang Yihan didn't even react. Yeah, that's nice. Former world champion, Wang Yihan won the world title 19. in 2011. Yeah, it's a super shot. The game points have arrived. Five of them, to be precise, for Tai Su Ying. Savisova. Second time of asking, and Tai Su Ying takes the opening game 21-16. Tai Yu Ying, 21-16. 17 minutes of play, and the opening game to the 20-year-old from Taipei. I think he's saying something about smashing down the forehand side. Well, may he's, maybe he's urging her to use that disguise drop shot a little bit more. Of course, Tyson Ying's going to have to be a little more careful with the punch clears from this near side of the court. Yeah, she looks perfectly relaxed, doesn't she? Little smile to her coach as he leaves the court. Court one, 20 seconds. Court one, 20 seconds. Second game, low wall, play. So if the two-time defending champion wants to add her list, her name to the list of players who have achieved one consecutive low. titles at the same Super Series tournament, and there's only one other women's singles player who's achieved that, she needs to really up her game here. Going out. Yeah, well, she played a winner from it anyway. Guy Su Ying. Oh, low. Service oh. over. One, two. Yeah, 
There's the drift coming Go. into play. Oi. in the rally more Wang Yi Han dictating the pace and I think that's what she has to do because her opponent has got such disguise on her shots that when she's in control of the rally that's where she's best to take away that control make sure you're dictating the pace first four two I suggested absolutely taking the rally and the point to her opponent and all of a sudden it's Tai Su Ying who's been pushed and pulled and made to move from one side to another that desperation or did she just not get behind the shot yeah a bit of both I think Done it. Well, this is extraordinary. Seven straight points now for Wang Yihan. Love two down in this second game. Now seven two up. Oh, I missed it. Eight straight points. What Eight. on earth has happened? Two. Well, I said she needed to up her game, Wang Yihan. She's done precisely Four. that. Four. Now the run comes to an end. I'm fairly fortunate then for Tai Su Yin nine. because I think her return of serve may have been taken by the drift and may have been going wide.
well played by the defending champion. Look at that slice. That's what you call totally outmaneuvered. Judge changing his mind, calls it in in the end, and that's Service the over. right decision. Four, it's clearly in. I'm surprised the umpire didn't intervene and confirm the call. Oh. It's gone long. Service over. 11-4. Seven-point advantage. 11-4, the scoreline. So 11 of the last 13 points to Wang Yi Han. Two love down she was in this second game. What a transformation. What a difference the drift makes. Chen Jin. Winner of the men's singles here four years ago. Now coaching the women's singles players. The man in the bright yellow Sport track one, suit top. 20 seconds. Spot one, 20 seconds. Second game. To the defending champion Wang Yi Han, Tai Soon Ying, one game to the good. Oh, she's overdone that again. 12 4. Nicely done. 13 4. 13 and 15 points now. Landed in. Well, looks pretty four. much certain we will be treated to a third and deciding game. Ten points the advantage now to Wang Yi Han. Magnificent. Well, the physical effort to still play the round, the head shot, paying dividends. Huge physical effort. Well played. Yeah. Service over. Nice assumes too little, too late. Sabisova, so over, 16 Tyson has lost interest in this second game.
17. Well, it's a dangerous tactic to play, in my opinion. Save yourself for a third and deciding game. I can understand when a player is this far adrift. I can understand why they do it. Oh! Mm, guess correctly. <laughs> Just wide. Savisova, 6 17. Well, as far as I'm concerned, I always like to feel that I was in good form prior to the start of a deciding game, which means that you've got to keep your form going in the second, even if you can't win it. Savisova, 18 6. of defiance. Sobi Sova, 7, 19. Shot. Service over, 8.20. Yeah. 9.20. Both players playing well at the same time in the third and deciding game. Tai Su Ying was really dominant in the first, and in contrast, Wang Yi Han has been totally dominant in the second. That's gone long. 21 9 in the second game in favor of the two time defending champion, Wang Yi Han. 21-9, one game on. 34 minutes into the match. And it's one game all. Chin saying something about the round the head shot. And get your feet in position. Oh. 
What one twenty seconds? What one finals for this young lady? Having won four of them. Wang Yi Han has been in an incredible 27 Super Series tournament finals, having won 20 of those 27. That is a remarkable record. Final game, low ball, play. So here we go, third and deciding game, women's single semi-final. Service over, one low. Opened up the gap with a punch clear. Service over. Had ties to Ying. Two. Over three, one. Yeah, really good aggression from Tai Su Ying. One. Tangle. Five, one. She had a lovely smash straight down the line. Six, well, what on earth one. do you do against net play like that from Tai Su Ying? Great courage as well from the youngster. Deep into the forehand corner of the defending champion, over, forcing the error. Seven, two. Yeah, bring her forward to the forehand net and then smash on the backhand side, then deep in the forehand corner. Service over, three, seven. her opponent was asking her to change the shuttle. Ah! Four, 
for seven. Yes, Wangi Han desperately trying to keep on the attack. That will stop her opponents being able to play an awful lot of her disguise shots. Oh, unbelievable net shot. Once again from Tai Su Ying. Hit the top of the tape. Crawled over. Oh, that's what you call perfection. Bye. idea High execution and a puzzled look on the face of defending champion Wang Yi Han. She wasn't moving for it at all. Obviously, yeah. shot would have been straight five. down the line, but to smash across court, wonderful awareness, coupled with good technique and good angle. Skies drop Soba, shot to once six, again ten. fails to make it. The anguish. Oh dear. Yeah, she says to herself that would have been an outright. Look where she she is on court though. Nowhere near the back of the court. This time Third time lucky on the attempted slow drop shot. And after two errors, finally makes the winner. Now, just shows how good it is when it works. Yeah, that shuttle landing well in front of that front service line just an indication of just how accurate it was and how good that drop shot was so a four point advantage one, for Tai Su seconds. Ying against Ward the one, number four seed
Well, the big question is, has Tai Su Ying built up enough 11, seven, points play. as a cushion now that she's down what is perceived by the players to be the bad end? watching that racket head very carefully, trying to see if there's a telltale sign so that I know where she's going cross court when she's going straight. And I can't see it, I have to be honest. Preparation seems exactly the same for every shot. Service over, 9-12. in these so first few rallies since the change 13, of ends nine. than she was in the second game, Tai Su Ying. She went a little bit passive. An awful lot of that, of course, was due to the good play of her opponent. the problem it's taken with the drift service over 11 14 good flick serve all strings gone in the racket of Tai Su Ying all she can do is clear and hope she can control it but she can't yeah 12 14 broke the strings on the return of serve. He just wants to try out the new racket. Got behind the shuttle. 16, angle 12. winner. Yeah, really just a half smash. Angled and placement. Rather than power doing the damage. <laughs> what 
while it was a four point advantage at the mid game interval, and she's well. actually managed to increase that advantage. Now a five point cushion. Pressure with the disguise drives coming forward to the net from Tai Su Ying. Well, I posed the question had she got enough of an advantage to push home from the bad end? Well, it appears at the moment the answer is yes. Four straight points, crucial stage. Oh, she's missed it. Would you believe it? Wang Yi Han. Misses a sitter. 19, 12. And now, Tai Su Ying. Just two points away from a second final here at the Singapore Super Series events. net courts for Tai Su Ying and is Wang Yi Han's reign as champion here in Singapore about to come to an end six match points opportunities for Tai Su Ying after she was first in the final here in 2010, has got through to the final once again. 21-17, 9-21, in the deciding game. 21-16, 9-21, 21-14. So their confirmation of the score, 21-16, 9-21, 21-14 in the deciding game in a match just five minutes shy of the hour mark.
Horizon Singapore Sports Hub, and there's uh, where we're at, the Singapore Indoor Stadium. Of course, in a couple of months' time, Singapore will be hosting the 28th Southeast Asian Games. But we're at semi-finals day of the OUE Singapore Open. Three of our five semi-finals completed, and all three so far going the full distance. Next up is men's doubles and a first ever Super Series semi-final as a pair for Pratama and Suwadi. Up against the number three seeds, Endo and Hawakawa. Mixed doubles, of course, will finish off. And what a wonderful prospect that is.